Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Soap the Great, and I am playing once again on the Too Crafty Vanilla Amplified SMP server. How's everyone doing? Hope you're doing well. Today we're taking a break from the Guardian Farm itself, but we still need to do something in support of the Guardian Farm project. Yes, it is time to do some decorating, and to do that, well, I've worked a little, little thing out in creative. Not here on this server, but in my testing world that I've shown before on camera. And uh, yeah, I've worked something out, and it requires some stained glass. And to do stained glass, you need dye. And what better place to get dye than in a flower forest? So we're going to do something. I've already done one here. If you have been around my channel for a while, you might recognize this device it is a flower farm and this particular one gives us let's see let's get a little bit of bone meal here and hopefully we can see some of the flowers that this one will generate real quick there we go that's one of them right there is the allium and the poppy and back here nothing there we go so you can see some of the flowers that will generate in here because, if you didn't know, the flowers that grow are determined based on the seed of your world. So that's a little bit random. And the specific block position. So right here, that's negative 131, 72, 561. That is mixed somehow with the seed to randomly determine which flower grows. And of course, even within that, it can either grow grass or the flower. Now, or in that case, if it is already grass, it grows tall grass. And so you see, it's it's not always the most um, most reliable. But what we're going to do is build another farm because I need this one right here. I need the orange tulip because I need orange dye. So that's just to give you an idea of what we're going to be doing today. So hopefully I have all of the materials and I got too many repeaters. So let's check those back in so that I don't get builder's inventory. Do we have enough? We got enough stairs. Okay. So what we're going to do is dig a little area out. I want to keep this height because that's the Y level that I want. And then back here is where we're going to have the collection. Okay. I'm going to be picking up tons of seeds and flowers, and that's going to be somewhat annoying. So we'll do that just to give us a little bit. Let's pop that back. Okay. So, uh, and then we'll put another torch right there. And picking up dirt and all sorts of fun stuff. Okay, so what we do, we'll drop a chest right there, and we're done with that. We'll bring in some hoppers. And this is going to be our collection area. Okay, so what we've got is a little redstone machine that's going to alternatively shoot a dispenser of bone meal and then a dispenser with a, um, what's it, a uh, bucket of water in it. So that's what we've got to do here. So dispenser goes there for the bone meal and then back here right there yeah that's right okay and then we have to dig out underneath and we're gonna go let's fill out our wall first like so and then like so and I didn't put a corner piece over here no because I had the torch there and what's the center of that we got two there Two there yep so add a little light to the subject and that gives us the benefit also of a transparent block so we can open that chest and we'll just come around like so and you might hear me say like so a lot because we're kind of in tutorial mode as well not really that I'm keen on being in tutorial mode but you do what you got to do okay so we'll go here and 
Uno mas. Okay. All right. Now, uh, as you have, if you've been watching along in the mini series of the Guardian Farm, you will know that I am getting ready to move house. I guess that's how they call it in the UK. We don't tend to use that phrase so much here in the US, but we're getting ready to move house. And it has been a, an interesting process thus far. Tomorrow, at the time I'm recording, we are going to be getting the pictures done so we can get the house listed for sale on the... Oh, I didn't want to do that one. So we'll have to put that piece of grass back up there. Oops, excuse me. Um, yeah, so what you do is you, you get your house ready and then you get nice pictures taken of it. You spend a lot of time and money to get your house looking really nice so that other people can buy it. And that's what I've been doing. It's been somewhat bittersweet because there have been a lot of projects that I've had to do because I didn't get around to doing them earlier on. Is there something behind there? Let's see. I can't tell. Yeah, so I had to do this farm first because I had gotten it all wrong. It's been a while since I've made one of these and I got my own tutorial all mixed up and out of place. So we're just gonna, gonna dig a little bit more here. Let's see, that's two right there. And we should be coming up on the other dispenser. No, where is it? There it is. Is that right? Yeah, there's two, okay. Okay, we're good, we're good, good, good. And we'll just fill all this in that we don't need for the time being, but we may end up coming back to here and put down some torches so that we don't get any surprises. And then what we need to do is set up a little clock. So we got, nope, come on, block placement. Got that one, two away, got that one, that one, and that one. And then when I first did this, I did this all incorrectly. We need to make sure that we hit that first um, and shoot the bone meal and then we get the water streams and then we'll just do this one I've played with the timings a bit I want to make sure that the water gets cleared up by the time the bone meal shoots again so there we go uh, I think we're no we still got a little bit more on the repeaters but let's come in here with a slab that and like that this is the shovel of doom here and not that I stole it from doom who is also on this server no it's just a rather powerful shovel and right here we're gonna go with a an upside down stair because we don't want the water coming back and washing away all of the redstone and we still want to present a nope, nope, nope. I gotta do it from the other side. Oh well, so much for that. Let's go over here. So yeah, we're getting the uh, the photographer out tomorrow to take pictures of our house so that people will see the listing and be amazed and say, oh, I want to go visit that house. And then they will purchase it or somebody will purchase it and we can move and Bob's your uncle. Um, but it is, I, you know, I, I say it somewhat jokingly, but it is bittersweet. Um, we've had a lot of good memories in this house. Our family started, we, we bought this house soon after we, well, about a year or so after we got married. And uh, we, yeah, we, it was just the two of us when we first bought it and and our family has gotten started uh, after being here for a couple years and yeah it's you know it's it's just one of those things we're gonna be we're excited for the new things ahead but of course we are nostalgic about the things we're leaving behind so uh, that maybe that's the case with you too if you've had to move 
Have you had the same feelings? Kind of bittersweet, if you will. Let me know. I'd love to hear from you. Oh, and nighttime cometh. Let's go sleep away the night because I don't want any nasties coming and messing with me while I'm doing redstone and talking to you. So, get rid of that. And that gives me an indication of how long I have been recording. It's about 10 minutes. But, uh, but yeah, what we'll do, we'll finish up here real quick. I've done a little bit of landscaping around here too. This wasn't here before, but I thought, you know, that, that's a nice place for a, a little pond. So I'll just put it in. Over here is Aniki's Mountain House. And uh, I think Aniki has abandoned it and gone to the New Lands. But uh, hopefully this is not interfering with anything. So I'm going to do this and that. And another one. And you might be wondering, what in the world are you doing here? So I am making a switch. Okay, so you see that? And then what we do is... How about get out the right tool for the job? Not like that. Oh, inventory. Inventory clog. Ah, okay. So what we need here, and I had to pull that block out anyway. Go like that, like that. Another torch. And over here, we're gonna do a dropper. Yes, I have one on hand. And then make sure I don't lock myself in here get another hopper and what else furnace that's just to block that hopper we'll put a piece of dirt and then what do we do next well we got to take a signal out of here so what's going to happen is the um, switch turns on powers this block which extends that sticky piston and it also puts a signal out of this rising edge detector. Then we detect that with a comparator. So we'll turn that off real quick. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. It's hard to see. Uh, well, well, we'll see soon enough once all of this goes in. Okay. And I still should have left a piece of dirt there. And we're going to run this signal here and another one here and then we're done with the comparator so we'll do a repeater and a repeater and then redstone dust and we should hear this get started okay you ready yep hear that so we should be getting a signal out of here and then a signal out of here do I have any more nope I don't so let's go and let's turn that off and we'll go get another bucket and also some bone meal and we can put away these flowers we'll get some more of that and I had a bucket over here yep there we go so now what we're going to do is fill this in and then come over here and that was on this line yep there we go and what we're going to do is make this a little easier to fill in with bone meal like that oh my yeah, let's just do that, that, and, and we'll do another one just for good measure, and then we'll bring a chest in, and nope, now that's going to get put into that hop or the dispenser, and we'll just fill this up with some more bone meal, and this is really the one I want. I don't care so much about the allium at the moment. Uh, and I'm, I'm sorry, Allium, but yeah, I, I don't need you quite yet. I need the orange dye. Yep, yeah, there we go. Get my hopper back. And so you see, what uh, we do is we get a little bone meal out in the middle. 
and that gives us some flowers but a lot of grass as well so we'll end up with a bunch of seeds but we'll just let this run and there you have it there's a flower farm we got two here and that's going to give us um most of the flowers let's see what we got white tulips the other tulips that we're not going to get this time are pink tulips they're growing right here but not in here i tried i really did try but i just couldn't swing it so if we need some pink tulips in the future we can make another one of these but let me let me just do a little bit of cleanup around here and we will call this project done yep we'll fill all this in and make it look like nothing ever really occurred and there you have it uh is this oh not good let's uh let's cover this up yep there we go nothing happened you don't see any redstone there we go a flower farm is done and i'm just going to be collecting the orange ones and and yeah and so next time we'll be back at the guardian farm and we'll be working on a little bit of a design so we're getting away from some of the functionality but going into some of the form so join me for that i'm looking forward to it i'm really excited about the design i have and i hope you will be as well so until then thank you so much for watching and i will see you next time bye bye